that bitch a clap I'm Manuel Santilla, 16, a journalism student, a student teacher, an advocate of media and information literacy, and a transfer student of a San Maria College Foundation. Teacher Erica Fernandez, an MIL teacher at the San Maria College Foundation. What is your class of student, Manuel? Ah, that's Manuel. He's a great guy. As the grades. Ever since he transferred here in our school, he is really vocal and passionate about journalism. In fact, favorite subject nga niya, MIL, Hindi Mobile Legends. <laughs> Pero media information literacy. Sophia Boris, the class president. Yes, ever since he came to our school, um, he's been very, very friendly to everyone. And in fact, most of the teachers like him. Uh, he taught me stuff and also hobbies for life. Altea Longino, a social media influencer with a huge amount of followers. What's your first impression of Manuel? First impression of him is that he's really good. Like legit. Because I didn't even think that he's approachable. And neither am I. But I'm shocked because he's the first one who came to me. And I was like, he's very good. And we became friends. We papa help na din ako sa math ko kasi I'm kind of a hobby. Oh, yeah. I could Dominguez, the class clown. Ah, uh, opo. Napakasarap nga ang uh, ating pasama at nakakasabay ko din sa trip eh. <laughs> Tapos isa pa, ang pagkatalino rin niya. Doon na ang umiingin ang sagot eh. <laughs> Secret lang po yun ha. Nakagad din po ako lumalapit kung meron akong problema eh. He's really active joining organizations and stuff. That's why he's always on top when it comes to curricular activities. Napaka-friendly na bata. Nagtuturo yun sa other lower grade levels sa junior high. Siya nga naka-influensya sa mga klase niya na mahalin ang media and information literacy. The subject, just ko, alam mo noon, hate na hate talaga ng mga bata ang subject na MIL. Kasi iba-iba sila ng pagtingin at karanasan sa media. Yeah, before my perception and how I see India is bad and awful. Because people often use to spread misinformation or what we call this And lately, it has also been eroded with toxicity. People are taking advantage of the platform. And also, big people with their news to make way for the oppressors, which is kind of disappointing. 
Pangit po kasi ng mga balita sa media, mga fake news at lahat. Pero sinabi sa akin ni Inman na hindi naman ganun kasama ang media. Marami din itong natutulong sa atin. Siyempre, gaya ko. Yung mama ko nasa abroad po sir Kaya komunikasyon namin sa isa't isa ay true FB po At masabi sa akin ni Emma na ang FB ay isang media Ay bobo po talaga no Doon ko na realize bobo po talaga ako Hindi ko na malaya na malaki na pala na itulong na media Sa akin syempre Pero alam mo nung pagdating ni Emmanuel Because of his love in media information news, <laughs> na convinced niya ang mga klase niya na mahali at magustuhan ang subject na ito. Um, after a month, okay. everyday life. Um, um, media helps us get real information. The current issues of our global community that us people should be involved. Kung makapag-comedy ka sa aking mama, sa ibang bansa, hmm, hindi naman pala ganun ka sa mga media. Uh, may naitutulong naman pala ito sa atin siya. Oo, okay. Importante nila ko sa mga swila. Ako po as a social media influencer that has so much I just really post a lot and I didn't realize my impact on them. Small followers call that until Emmanuel said to me that I can use this platform to spread awareness and legit news through IG, FB, YouTube, and TikTok and other social media platforms. Listening to Pink Panam by Blackpink. Oh.